What's up guys? My friend Dusty from Storage Wars, he just bought a locker right here for a thousand dollars. So it's about 35 bucks a box in little ones, plus we got the trunk. Good, it kind of looks like an older person. It's interesting, those type of lockers, you can score big, or you can cry for a very long time. So he took a gamble, but they're clean packed. We're gonna show you, as long as my phone doesn't die with battery, I'm about to put Dusty on camera. He's gonna go through the boxes, tell you what's in there. By the way, guys, in the comment section right now, I'm gonna link his social media so you guys can give him a follow on Instagram. He shares a lot of really cool finds, and I'm trying to press him to start his own YouTube channel because he buys some really good lockers. He has a good eye. Um, you guys watch Storage Wars. He's a pain in my butt. But overall, you know, if you take the business side away from it, he's actually a really good guy. He's really smart. And um, yeah, let's see what he got because we only got 10% of phones, so we're gonna try to go. All right, Dusty, start pu pulling out boxes. You know what I like to do, just like storage ones. I like to stack a couple, just way my table. Yeah. Make it oh, easier for you. Right. You don't open the first one. You don't want to open Mo's random stuff. Actually, it might be a good one. Let's put the book ones on the bottom. Okay. So. It's a leaf and. Well, so real obvious. quick for like the people that are trying to do this business, why did you buy this unit? Uh, just clean. Well, the grab and go. You know, as you see. Easy pickup, it carries a little more premium on the price of the uh, gamble. That is true. People like to, you know, not work as hard. How do you feel about it now that you see it in person? Uh, the boxes definitely shrink from the photos. You know, they look huge and when you sit here, they're tiny. And if you look at this box, it looks like, uh, looks like crap. We got a little ring box though. Uh -uh. Oh, ring box, here we go. Empty. Empty. That's about uh, typical, right? Yeah, I, I mean, I barely ever find anything in ring boxes. This looks like this new garbage. All right, so the first box is not promising. Those are Versace glasses. Really? Yeah, good start, right? That is a good start. Maybe like 50 bucks, right? So we're in Carlsbad, and actually, we are right around the corner from my store. He called me. He's like, hey, are you around? So I'm like, yeah, that's what, uh, there we go. There's some games. PSP. It's PSP. Oh, and it's good games, too. There's more. Oh, score. Good. He's going to sell me these for 40 bucks. Now he knows better, unfortunately. But we gotta put these aside. If we have battery life at the end, we'll show them. Yeah. Oh, but there's Kingdom Come in there, Adventure Games, so that's a good score. Yeah, it's something. Hey, it's off to a good start. It's better than a, oh, it's a PC. PC game. Okay, that's good. So we're about 35 bucks a box, right? Yeah, 35 a box. So that box was a winner. And the box is talking to us. And my battery just set 10%, so. We'll try to show you guys as much as we can. Oh, well, party photos. Huh? It says party photos. Uh-oh. And family photos. Yeah, well, that'll be a quick walk. Oh. It's oh. just files, vintage. Yeah. Make sure. Ooh. Ooh. There you go. Let's so say hopefully we got the class ring in there, you know. And Awards and medals. Okay. These look old, blue ones. Yeah, let's open some of these up. That looks like, uh, ooh, that's gold right there, brother. Is it? Oh no, Avon. <laughs> <laughs> Same thing. Hey, hey. Just do what Daryl says. Just say it's gold. Aww. Look at the blue ones. I think those are old military awards. Aww. Aww just, yeah. yeah. Look good from far, but maybe far from good. Oh, there's your military medals. Yeah, but they're the common ones, unfortunately. Yeah. No, no named World War II purple hearts around. But man, they didn't leave us any full jewelry boxes. They just like it should say awards and medal boxes. Combat bars, those are cool. There's a little piece of uh, trench art. Oh, that's cool. Where they made a little cross out of a bullet. That's uh, from hours of boredom out wherever they were fighting. Yeah, that's cool. Fashion Mom right. Science Award, a little bronze. That's cool. Science Award, something. Well, you know what? There's an, you know what? We're not that excited, but there's enough stuff in here to get your money back on eBay right here already. Just uh, on that box, you know, your 40 bucks. Yeah, a little. Hey, as long as it averages out to 40 bucks. Now, you know, we got to dig through the family photos and make sure we. Yeah, let's not show those on camera. We'll go to the next one. No, I know. I'm just making sure there's no more jewelry in there. So, you know what? I mean, it doesn't look great, but it also doesn't look bad. You know what? Let's dig straight for the trunk. You're going to go for the trunk? I'm going to go straight for the trunk. You're going to baronize it? Before your phone goes, what is this, dude? Oh, oh that's a... Uh, stock certificate. Yeah, that's for an LLC like, they yeah, had. Yeah, this looked like a... Uh, that's the, it's a stamp. Yeah, for people to do the... Uh, you know, the one thing that scared me a little bit was about that art easel, because that's like the basic cost for one. Yeah, I was just like, you get like 20 bucks. Yeah. For the, uh, what I call the aspiring artist. The aspiring artist. Yeah, there's like a little, little close. Yeah, you never know. Let's see if there's any good ones. If they're modern. Modern. Yeah. 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 <laughs> We've bought better. 
Yeah. Looks like you never know. This is a long drive for you too, right? It's about an hour and a half each way? Yeah, an hour. I'm just Orange County with no traffic. You know, I'll see you on the way back. Yeah, look at this. We got random art stuff in storage. That's price supply. Heavy? Let's go straight to the. Oh, yeah. At least a trunk you get 50 bucks, right? Yeah, it's nice wood carving. Just put That's some like lemon oil on that sucker. Like nobody's touched it in a long time. No fingerprints. Let's see. Okay. Oh, never mind. So actually, I see a good piece right here. You'd be surprised what some of these little plastic soldiers are worth. Little dinosaur guy, that's kind of poster. Oh, that's good. That's kind of interesting, huh? Drawing of a rocket. United States, it's just... It's like Apollo 11. Yeah, but is that something he did or is it like something official? That's just something he did, I think, huh? Yeah, well, he was an artist. We do see the easel. Yeah, actually be careful with this. Some of these from the 60s go for like yeah. several hundred bucks a piece. I have a bunch of these. A little dime store there. Well, well it's not just dime store. They could be marks and stuff from like certain sets. You know what we do with good smalls? We just in pocket. Them right in the cargo. So the, the ones you want to find is like, that only came with certain play sets that were really expensive back in the day. Well, the trunk is what I was really hoping to uh, score. Yeah, I like these I like these trunks, you know, where people keep all their, there's a poster. It's a poster by Beach Boys. Where's that? What year is that? Beach Boys and Concert at the Anaheim Stadium. We got three of them. Four. Does it say here? Uh, well, I mean, it was $7.50 for a ticket, so, I mean, it had to be somewhat of a while ago, right? Yeah. When's the last time you've been to a $7.50 concert? Uh, it's been a while. Backstage. Here's the backstage pass. Who's that for? August 5th. Here's Tax the production. Look, America. Have you been through the desert on a horse with no name? Lately, yes. Yeah. So I'm trying to find water. What's the lyrics for that? Oh, very good. Who is this guy? Dave yeah. Mason. Some sort of artist. That sounds like a really familiar name. But those backstage passes are cool. I mean, what do you yeah, think? It posters and passes? Like, if you're unlucky, 200, right? If you're lucky, yeah, 500 to 1,000. 40, 50 a poster. People like the Beach Boys, thankfully. Oh, wait a minute. We're blind. We missed the gold. Right in front of our faces. Okay, so that looks like gold. Yeah, that's a, a high school ring. What year? Stick that right on the pinky. Uh, 1960. Okay. And this is a little Victorian gold. You can tell right away. Missing the little tiny diamond, but the onyx, but it's okay. Okay. So I guess the trunk we can accept. Now I gotta flip through this little bit of paper, check a couple of these envelopes, got some Roman candles, and some first grade something. Just rip the stack of money. Ooh, it has hair in it. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm all right on that. Look at this little guy. You got some new teeth, man. Oh, no, perfect. Beautiful. All right, guys, we're getting you some footage. Just so you know, if this video ends, we ran out of battery. But we figured we'd show you something better than nothing. Hey, let's, uh, this is random art stuff. So this is probably going to be better. That's new stuff, I bet you. Yeah. Well, maybe it's Mo and parents, you know? This looks like crap. This looks like some, uh, who knows if they have a new one. A little camera. Nah. Junky camera. Looks like an underwater digital camera. Here, see if any boxes have dick, because I'll label it. See if we can find one that's labeled interesting. Yeah. Before all battery dies. Let's move this. Okay, let's find the one that says Moe's Jewelry. <laughs> well, there's, we got family grade books, more family books, CDs and tapes. What's Italiano? Italian? Italian books, maybe? It could Some be books. books, it could be just, you know. I don't know, we're, we're up to box eight of books, so we might be able to. Uh oh. Maybe. Oh. Are these going to be straight Italian books? Could be art books, Italian artists. People in the Swami like the books, so they're okay. These look like regular books, so... It's in English. Oh, Ultimate Italian, that's why you probably added that. Yeah, that's eh. no good. That's boring. Eh. That's to the heat. I don't like it. I don't like it when they uh, reuse boxes. I don't like it either, yeah. I like one-time used boxes. These look like all books. CDs, tapes, books, books. Let's see, what does it say? Books. CDs could be good. Yeah, let's see what kind of quality. Let's open up a CD and tape. Let's see what kind of quality we have. From a lot of CDs. Well, I expect to see the Beach Boys in America. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's a very safe guess. And I see no. Douglas oh. Adams. Oh my gosh, is it classical? These look like audio. This is like audio uh, books. There's not that much. Oh, oh, wait a second. Oh. Is that Eastern? Oh no, it's not. It's Franklin. Yeah, audio books. It's boring. Yeah. 
Yeah, you know what? At least you got the post and the gold already. That almost makes you even. So, like, even with all this stuff, you're not gonna lose any money. What is this? Books. Old. Let's see. This says bedroom desk. Sometimes, oh, let's see. Bedroom desk. Sometimes we keep some better stuff in the desk. I've seen people hide good stuff in their desk. Oh, that's a boring bedroom. More desk. books. More books. Mail. Bills. Amazon down there. That's gonna be where the, oh, that's just 2015 notice of payment. Not boring. This is gonna be a quick video. A quick one. But you know what, if you buy locket, it's not gonna make you a lot of money. It's great to be done in 10 minutes sometimes, you know? Hey, that's why these grab and go specials are nice sometimes. <coughs> easy clean, easy exit. Let's see, let's see, let's see what the great books is. Leave family great books. Great books. Let's see what books are great. Their idea of, sometimes some people's idea of great books are much different than mine. Maybe it's Eastern Press. Oh, that is Eastern Press. There you go. Okay, so he just scored. Do you know Eastern Press? Yeah. Okay. So these books, guys, I used to sell these Eastern Press books in my store at a minimum of 30 bucks a piece. Then we got the rest of the set here. Well, what do you want to look for? Well, this? we got great books, uh, number eight. You want to find the signature. And like one of the easy things that gives it away... So obviously for people, I don't know, almost all Eastern Press books, right here you see in the spine it says EP, Eastern Press. I think all these boxes that say great books are the whole set. Oh, well, oh, you know what? Eastern Press did a set and it is their lowest, but it's like 100 great books throughout history, 100 great books throughout the world. Some books. But still, they're all really good books, so um, 30 bucks a book. So if you got all 100 in there, 30 bucks a piece, that's $3,000. Not bad for a little uh, quick grab. Yeah. And I get to see your warehouse. And you get to see my warehouse. What's this? Oh, those great books. You're right. It's like you can read through the side of the box, man. But this is Britannica. This is different. So Britannica apparently did a version too, but I don't know what these are worth. No more boring. Huh. Well, Eastern Press, I can see right here what we got here. Three, six, 12, 13, 25. I see 25 Eastern Press books easily. Looks like some decent CDs. Fleetwood Mac, Santana. Yeah. Van Halen. Just I mean, in our store, back. we started selling these at five bucks a piece. They were selling like crazy. The Ray Bans in here. Nope. Nope. Just a case. No, nope. like great little books. So you got more great books. Great, I great books. books are all. Uh... Let's slash them really quick. See, do we have Eastern Press or do we have Britannica? Oh. You want Eastern Press? Okay? okay, that's Eastern Press. Most probably. Oh, here's Franklin Library. That's funny. But again, the Frank I get the same money. It's 30 bucks a piece. That's the rest of the Britannic. That's Britannic. I don't know about that. I mean, they're leather bound books. Oh, there's Easton down here, too. We got Easton. We got a mixed bag. That's great. Mixed Easton Press Britannic. You don't have to open the rest. If you, unless you want to. I don't mind. Let's check the weight. Make sure they're all booked. It's going to be more Easton Press. This feels like books, feels like books, feels like books, feels like more books. Nice. So oh, let's see what most books are. See if there's special in there. Actually, you know what? This locker went from shitty to a score. Hey, anytime find a little gold and some good books. Looks like grandpa's books are better than Moe's. It's probably a little mix. Tapes. Let's see if anything else. Hi, a bunch of CDs down there. I see these are good though, you know? So, I think it's good. Let's look at the PSP games really quick because we still have battery. Yeah, you're good. Turn the nickel into a dime, right? I think it's a good buy. It's uh... Let's see, let's see this. We want to, yeah, obviously the adventure games. Ghostbusters sucks, Harry Potter sucks. 300. Oh, so they also did movies on that system. Yeah, I remember Death, Death Ray. I saw, oh, here's um, Frantics. I don't know this one. We got here. Resident Evil. That's okay. So you you want the um. So that this is movie flight plan movies. I saw one when we first opened. Oh yeah, here Kingdom Paradise. I think that's okay. I mean, but they're okay. You know, I mean, like you said, forty bucks is probably more money than forty bucks, and it depends how many movies. Tomb Raider. Let's see what you got here. Medieval. Wipeout. Ghost Recon. Pirate. Nah, it's okay. Looks like some uh, Kinder games mixed with some cool games. Yeah, it's cool. I mean, it's overall good. Hey. All right, Dusty, final words. Well, 
I made a drive, but at least I made some money. I think it's good, right? Yeah, it's okay. Where can they find you on Instagram if they want to follow your adventures? Uh, Dusty, period, my last name, R-I-A-C-H, period, vintage. Okay, cool. And then also, uh, are you going to do a YouTube channel? Someday, hopefully. What if this video gets a thousand likes? Will you start getting busy? Maybe I'll make one for you. Okay, thousand likes. So if not, if you guys like Dusty on there, maybe because he's buys out here all the time too. Maybe we'll show some of his videos because you do have a good eye. I'll just let you come. Huh? You would have loved to come to the one last week. <laughs> <laughs> all right.